Hey you guys, it's Tony here. Just going around checking the street lights that I've put up, the old vintage ones. Don't know how well you can see that one there, but that's a um it's a Benjamin Rotolux street light. I've actually built the pole myself. Well the gooseneck bracket that goes on. It's a 35 watt metal halide lamp, it's um built into a um GLS lamp glass. Um Bear with me for a second, we'll go and have a look at the um, the Ezra type street light which I've um, cast myself, which is also <laughs> working out the back. So I've got quite a few street lights running. Uh, we'll be looking at four of them at the moment. You can see just through there, it's a bit muddy. I thought I heard something. Um, I've only got shoes on, just getting past the mud. Pretty muddy here. Mm -hmm. So you can see that street light there, that's the Isla type that I cast. Extremely good reflector as you can see. Don't know how well these are going to come up on the camera, hopefully you can see actually how they work. So it also made the gooseneck and the fitting itself, so it's all cast aluminium and then the steel pipe. Um, then we go up top, um, up by the shed there you can see there's another two street lights up there, one's a 35 watt low pressure sodium. The other one is a that LED bulb, you can see how much that's dimmed out. Um, so I've actually been upgrading them, so that metal, oh, that radio wave will also be upgraded to a metal halide. But I might, um, I might go for a 70 watt up there, being a much higher pole. So we'll go to the um, low pressure sodium side first. It's actually a clear night tonight. Yeah. Man, it is clear tonight. Look at that. Man. What a mean night, it's so clear, we haven't had um, nights like this, it's been raining and everything wet. Um, so that's a Thorn Better 5 as a street light, I got four of them from England. Actually, well I got them off eBay and got them sent over. So yeah, Thorn Better 5 street light. Low pressure sodium. And then... Last one I'll be looking at tonight will be the um, the radio wave one, which you saw in my last video. <laughs> That's that same LED bulb, but it's gone as dim as anything now. Yeah, it's one thing they don't mention of LED bulbs is they're like fluorescent tubes; their phosphor inside wears out and they go dim. Yeah. Um, the thing I like about metal halide is generally it either goes or it doesn't. So. <laughs> The bulb um, goes out and then you just replace it. Oh guys, well that's a bit of a look at the old street lights. I'm gonna um damn sisters dogs. I'm gonna go back and um uh, have a look at the other one down the front that I've just um, upgraded to metal halide as well. Oh guys, we'll see you next time. Yeah.